Thanksgiving and Thanksgiving dinner just days away right now. We've learned five Connecticut Boston market locations received eviction orders this month. And our Channel 3 consumer investigative reporter Cassidy Williams is live outside the store in Newington. And Cassidy, we know that you checked in on quite a few locations today. Yeah, Mark and Aaron, we stopped by four Boston Market locations and all had this same sign that says sales are suspended. The lights are off, meaning if this was your plan for Thanksgiving dinner, you have only a few days to find another option. Didn't want to cook. I figured I'd come here. Um, you know, they got good chicken. Steve Brainerd came to the Newington Boston Market Monday, hoping to place his Thanksgiving order. Instead, he was greeted by this sign. I'm kind of surprised because they got, you know, I like Boston Market. The sign says the restaurant was shut down by the Department of Revenue Services on November 9th. We found the same sign with the same date at the Meriden, Milford, and West Hartford locations, too. The signs caught the attention of David Gustafson. He says he's seen a decline at the West Hartford location over its 30 years. I've noticed as I've come by here over the last year, it did seem there were less people that were eating here. Online court records show Boston Market's legal issues extend all across Connecticut. Twelve different locations have faced civil actions in the last two years. Five spots received eviction orders within the last month. The evictions and lawsuits are all related to landlords accusing Boston Market of not paying tens of thousands of dollars in rent. In Newington, the landlord filed a complaint saying Boston Market stopped paying rent in April. Boston Market never showed up to court, so a judge ruled them to evict in July. But in early November, the Newington location still accepted Channel 3's own Thanksgiving order for employees working the holiday. Oh, we'll have to go somewhere else, plan B, I guess. With little information from the company, it's unclear if the lights will ever turn back on. Boston Market has not returned our quest, request for comment. We've also sent emails and called this location asking about our holiday orders as well as other customers' holiday orders. We also have not heard back from them. If we learn anything more about what this means for people that placed an order, we'll provide updates both on air and online. Live in New Newington, Cassidy Williams, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Cassidy.